What about the double? Or emerald key, whatever that is. Sapphire key. Alright, we got the key! The Madman! A blind ascetic who has come to evaluate the Spire, master of the divine stances, at the start of each combat, add a miracle to your hand. Urchings. At least confront the first boss. Poor me, I haven't even started. Okay, so, where are all the cool question marks at? The right side. Whoa, this thing's on fire! Oh, we gotta check that out. Miracle. Retain. Retain cards are not this card at the end of the turn. Gain energy. Now, oh, what is my deck? Enter Wrath. In the stance you deal and receive double attack damage. Enter Calm. On exiting the stance, gain two. Interesting. Enter Wrath! Gar. Deals a lot of damage. At the start of each turn, add Smite to your hand. Evaluate Shuffle and Insight into your deck. And Protect. Gain 12. Wow, Retain. Let's see, like, really avoid RNG. So do I want to just get a 1 mana deal 12 each turn? Seems good. False is a rare. Another battle him! Alright, we're now smite deck. It's it's on discount. I have to get that. Oh, that also has retain. Sick. Yeah, just enough mana. Money. Alright, well, Strike is completely outclassed by Battle Hill. And then I just need to find some way to cheat lots of mana or something. Wait, I'm going to have so many cards. That could be really bad. I might have to just go for max HP plus 5 here. Donut! You eat the donut! Yum. Oh, the miracle is always... This. Cool. Smite! The wicked. Is this lethal? Nine plus twenty four? Yeah, that's a lot of damage. Whew. Some early game power here. Enter Calm Exhaust. And then Tranquility gets me the mana when I want. Yeah, yeah. Or perhaps is good. It, it seems good. Enter Calm. You need block. Let's see, if I erupt, then I can enter calm after. This will deal 18 damage. I think I have lethal. Ah, oh, yes. Also, oh right, I gain mana. Whenever you change stances, return this from the discard pile to your hand. Deal 9 damage, exit your stance. Gain 7 block, exit your stance. I think I'll need the 0. And that'll probably add in a decent amount of damage or something. Alright, it's on fire! What did this mean? I guess it's a stronger version of the normal.
Wait, was that an attack? Oh, right, it's normally four. Oh. And then do I want to coin out my battle him? All right. Oh, 27. Okay, so I'll gain lots of mana. So this is basically free. So I have three mana after that. But I have lethal. 9, 24. Okay, I should add this and then double. It's 18, 36. 36, 45? I can throw in a smite and then vigilance back. Key, whatever that is. Smelling mess. The removal service now always costs 50. Cool. Emerald key. Ooh. Deus ec machina. When you draw this card, add two miracles to your hand and exhaust. That just seems great. Fantastic. Finding gold. Idol. Ooh. 25% more gold. Take 21, lose 6 max, become cursed injury. 6 max HP is like nothing. Uh, 21. That's nothing. Recall. Obtain the ruby key. I should rest. Heal for 30% of your max HP 25. But what if I didn't? Just seeing what cool cards I have. Three miracles. Six damage. Zero mana. Neat the battle him. That's that doesn't matter. Eruption costing one less is pretty useful. This card though will always get me one freebie mana. I think this is a good one. There's like no elites on the way. There's no way I'll die. Bag of prep, sapphire key. Wait. Where'd my key go? Did I have to choose one of the two? Hmm. Uh oh, I hope I can get that back. Gain five mantra. Enter Divinity. Gain 3 mana. Attacks deal triple damage. Shuffle your draw pile, scry 3. Hmm. Just remove a card, I think. Maybe I can build a mantra deck. No, there's no way. I can just waste mana on that. forgot about blocking after the last game. I have, what is this, four, five, six, seven cards in my hand? Oh, but that one goes away, of course. Oh, right, but I get six planned. Path Protect Sash Whip. 
Okay, I can't hold very many more retain cards. I guess skip. That wrath entering seems really good. Scrap ooze. Get some treasure. Take some damage. Blah blah blah. Found it. It's a fossilized helix. Prevent the first time you lose HP each combat. Nice. Ooh. You can no longer become weakened. I think I will take Sapphire Key. Apparently it's a really good treasure. Okay, I guess I'll take it. Alright, do I need any HP against the boss? I'll rest. Cowardly. Let me think. So the turn that I actually draw the miracle, I will get... Basically, I can't retain any cards. Because my hand is, uh, like, 10 by default. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Oh, no, I miscounted the one card. Anyways, that's going to be a lot of damage. So at... I should stop DPS around 70. So he is currently 49 above 70. That's 48. That's 20, that would put him at 75. That's good. That's a lot of damage. Oh, I don't have enough. Okay, I can just... Alright, I guess I'll toss this out. Diva form. At the start of your turn, gain mana and increase this gain by one. Wait, that's insane. If the enemy has 30 or less, set their HP to zero. Blah. Scroll. Draw cards until your hand is full. I mean, this seems really good. I am now a diva. You can no longer gain gold. You can no longer smith. Well, enemies drop 25% more gold. I guess we don't need to smith. Fusion hammer! Uh, let's see, it looks like I don't have enough money for the... For this. Oh no, I can just remove cards for 50. That seems like a good deal. So I should try to hit as many shops on the way. Good combo. So therefore... Ooh, one side's got a lot of question marks, but I want to hit an elite. So, I guess I'll go this way. Lights. Receives 50% less attack damage, cancelled if dealt attack damage three times. Change the stance. Oh, it does apply. Oh, it does, like, take into account the fact that you take double damage, so that's not four times five. Cool. I think I hit that while it's down and then I calm. That's cool. Oh, that's so much damage. Oh, but I can cancel it. Oh, but I can't. This would only, like, negate three damage, so whatever. Mm -hmm. 
hurt me less than I thought it would. Where are my attack cards? Oh, I removed them all from the deck. Oh, right. Pretty weird build. If you are in Wrath, apply 5 Vulnerable to all enemies, otherwise enter Wrath. At the end of your turn, shuffle an Insight, gain 4 out of safety. Yeah, I can Stance Dance more. Just seems kinda good. They all seem good. I think I forgot that I the other one comes with a freebie. Man, doubling all your damage is so much damage. Or rather, it's not doubling all damage, it doubles attacks damage. Gain 3 block if you are in Wrath. Gain 9 additional block. Gain 1 less at start of each turn. 3 strength, 3 dex. Yes. Ah, it's... You know, I really don't need this. I'm just gonna skip. That's... I can see that clogging up the deck. Oh, membership card. Apotheosis. Upgrade all your cards for the rest of combat. I don't think my cards upgrade to be that good. The game plan is to just play the battle hymns and the... Like, these cards don't even upgrade to anything good. And besides, I can't say no to the membership card. Oh, this doesn't uh, have the 50. Oh well. Unlock it. Line of hooded figures. You join the line and are quickly surrounded by cultists. You eye a donation box. Grab 99 gold. Obtain ritual dagger. Well, that seems good. You stay in line to see what will happen. Hands you an ornate dagger. Caw, caw, caw. Oh, more question marks. Red mess. Lose all your gold. Fight! I need my 14 money. That should be a pretty good first turn. Apply 5 vulnerable to all enemies. Yeah, that seems good. Grab him, bear. Alright, vulnerable. 18. That's 12. That's 30. I guess I kill this one. I mean, there's not actually much to think about. Oh, right, I'm in the wrong stance. Oh, I wonder if this... No, that doesn't deal 10. Wait, 
Did I have a buffer? When did I get buffer? Prevent the first time you would lose HP. Oh my god. That's so good. Red mask. Apply one week to all enemies. Nice. Shuffle an insight into your draw pile. Gain seven block. Scry three. Eh, skip. I'll find some cool way to spend mana later. Do I want to try to time that ritual dagger? Yes. I mean, certainly I should wrath with it. Now dealing I'm now drawing the two plus the five. So that's correct, I think. Flurry first. What? I think if you I thought if you change your stance from neutral to stance, that doesn't actually change your stance. Oh, that still works? Okay. I thought it didn't work that one time, but. That would have been a good time to gain four, probably. Get stabbed! Pick, choose a power card, start each combat with that card in your hand. You're in column, draw three, otherwise enter wallop. Deal 12, gain block equal to unblocked damage dealt. So that's basically deal 12, gain 12. Oh, de deal 24, gain 24. That's pretty good. I like that. Bottle Tornado, my Deva. Easy. Uh, going to that shop. So this probably makes sense to hit first. I can basically hit either two monsters or a bonfire and a monster. I think I'll hit the bonfire. Or I can recall, but I'll rest. Because I'm a coward. Deal 63. That's a lot of damage. This hand's pretty bad. 9 plus 6 is 15. That's not enough for that. Deal 20, draw 2. Just lucky. Scry 1, gain 2 block, deal 3 damage. Wheel kick plus. <sighs> I think... I mean, that looks good, but I can see that getting stuck in my hand. Alright, I think that's the mana sink. Also, it comes upgraded. I'll take it. Tiny chest. Every fourth room is a treasure room. Question room. I think it's time to grab the key. Yeah, I'll only get one at most. Oh. 
Sands of Time. Deal 20. Meh. Mark. New keyword. At the end of your turn, if you're in calm, gain 5 block. Master of Strategy. Draw 3. Wow. A boot. Whenever you would deal 4 or less unblocked attack damage, increase it to 5. Pretty pointless. I definitely plan to just remove a defend. Gets me 67, which is not really enough for anything. Alright, so boss, two question marks, and then fire. I think that's actually it. Actually, I probably should have eruption vigilanced. Eh, that's fine. Oh, I lost the... Oh my god, I lost my uh, <laughs> freebie damage. I buffered one damage, oh no. Oh my god, I got rid of all my defense. Twelve, thirty-six. Oh, I actually could kill both. Uh, but I'm only taking eight here. I think I'll just take the eight. Uh, six plus thirty. No, that's not enough. All right, I have to put all of them in. Gambler's Brew. Cool. Ragnarok. Deal 5 damage to a random enemy 5 times. Useless. Halt. Gain 4 block if you are in Wrath. Gain 14 additional block. Eh, it's upgraded. I think I'll take it. Yeah, that's fine. Eruption to do a little bit more damage. And vulnerable, perhaps? Yeah, sure. And then I'll swap it over to the other form. This is actually pointless, because I blocked the first damage. Oh. Oh, Wallop does a lot. 18 plus 40 gains me a lot of armor. Bursty. Whenever you add an attack into your deck, upgrade it. Add two miracles to your hand. Ah, oh, these are cool. Another wallop. Wallop seems cool. Wallop plus. Alright, question mark, question mark. A wall covered in the writing of ancients. Remove a card from your deck, upgrade all strikes and defense. Elegance. So now I have both wallops, so I can get rid of defense, I think. 
Another puppet of Niao. Ignore the others. Would you like a taste of our power? Receive five apparition. Lose 42 max HP. Gain one intangible. Uh, no, I think. Pretty exciting, though. And rust or recall? I think I'll recall. All right, we got the key. Wow. Not entirely sure what that does. Up against the champ. Full damage coming. So indignation into wallop. Seems good. See, I thought I would. Oh, yay. Ow. Alt plus doesn't do anything. Battle him. Kick into my uh, wallop, I guess. Easy. I'm a real bruiser here. Forty-eight coming. But I can calm down. Oh, I'm buffered. Oh, it's pretty good. I need to calm down. Oof. Also, a waste of... Oh wait, oh my god, maybe it is lethal. Oh, that's super lethal. That was a lot of damage. Oh, I also have, like, all these things. Lesson learned. Deal 13 damage a fatal upgrade a random card in your deck. Whoa. My stuff's already all upgraded. Scroll. Draw cards until your hand is full. Exhaust. That's pretty good once I'm, uh... And I don't think I want two diva form. Yeah, I think scroll is definitely right. That's a good finale. After I div it up, or something like that. Astrolobe. Transform three cards, then upgrade them. No. Transform all strike and defend cards. Cool. Future card rewards have two less cards. Uh, I think I'll go with the busted crown. That's a lot of paths. Okay, so I do want to focus on getting to a merchant. Sadly, they're right at the beginning. So if I want to fight elites, I take the right side. Whoa, that's so good. It's a swing of 48. Wait, I have lethal. Dang. <laughs> Stance potion. Oh, that's pretty useful. Just lucky plus. Scry 2, gain 3, block, deal 4 damage. Alright, you're good enough. Those all aren't good enough. Every three turns, gain a mana, meh. Enemies in elite combats have 25% less HP. Start each combat with an artifact. The artifact seems good. Removing a uh, strike seems good. Add a random colorless card into your hand. Meh. Take that. And 
I think everything else hurts the deck. Draw three and one of them explodes into the three. Yeah, it's probably good to draw it right now. Halt. That gets me enough block. Or this can just. Do I want to stab something right now? No. Yes, no. Mm. Going into Wrath seems good. I think I want to use the ritual to. Wait, how did I just gain that much armor? What did I do? Oh, 4 plus 14 is 18. That makes sense. Okay, so that's... what is it? 42 damage. Let's try to gain 3 block, deal 8. It's 48 damage. Alright, probably just go off this turn. Play it off. Choose any number of cards to discard. Thirty-six. Thirty-six, thirty-six, just lucky, that deals twelve, and a strike. That's one mana to kill that. It's definitely better than vaulting it. Hmm, good turn. <laughs> 59 armor! 77 armor, okay. And then I'll just deal 72. Cool. 96, actually. Deal 6 to eh, skip. Find some potions. Fire and Tropic Brew fill all your empty potion slots with random potions. Skill potion. Um. I'll take in Tropic. It's the mall! Looks kind of elite. <laughs> oh, artifacted. Whatever that was. And now I, uh, buffer the 50 damage. Cool. Seems good. I'll just stab this thing. Oh, it doesn't work. I have no deck. Skip. Okay. This one should be scarier. Alright, I remember this one. I was playing the uh, Orb Man, and he just randomly died. But this time around, I probably need to do better than just randomly killing them.
Yeah, the first turn they don't do that much damage, and then the second turn they do insane damage. I see how it works. Let's see, six mana, one, two, three... Okay, doesn't want an indignation to wallop. Unless I think that the uh, potion is necessary. I don't think it's necessary. Build 12... Build 24... Little wallop. Oh, wallop would give 24 there. Huh. I guess you don't overkill. I see. Oh, I shouldn't have... I currently have buffer. Rip me. I guess this is still good, though. Because I can... Hmm. Shovel, you can dig for relics at rest sites. Cool. Inner peace. If you're in calm, draw four. Nah. Well, now I can go here and dig. Negate next two curses. Okay. Uh, let's see. Upon losing HP, loses that much strength until the end of the turn. I might be able to... Negate the damage enough with the walloping. Pow! Wallop again. Or maybe not. Master of Strategy now? Oh no, obviously battle him. Let's see, is this? No, I never got to vulnerable it. There we go. Useless. That's actually a pretty bad ratio of damage. Do I have better? Not really. Another transient that I can't kill. Boo! It's actually kind of close. But not quite. Die. I mean, it didn't die, die. Uh, Swift Potion. Hmm. 
Deal three damage to all enemies. These are all the worst cards in my deck. No, I guess I just go Wrath. Yeah. yeah. Never mind. I was wrong. Actually, maybe I was right. Well, get rid of that 15 damage. And this is. Lots of block, I guess. And here I am saying my draw is bad. I'm bad. Hmm, Flurry of Blows plus. I actually don't change stances as much as I thought I did. Dig, dig. First time you lose HP, draw three. So much uh, digging in the lane. Nice. Hmm. That's well, 12 damage. Either way, it's always the same. Wait, was my math wrong somehow? The weak rounded. Oh, that's unfortunate. Eruption is in there, so it is good to just enter calm. Yeah, 90 damage is kind of a lot. When retained, increase its damage by 5. That's a lot of damage if I wait until the end. Just keep sitting it in the hand and then... Like, dealing 5 free damage each turn, maybe? I guess 5 damage isn't a lot. Potion slots. Why did I hit that one? No idea. No, oh, it died. attack deals double. Ooh, could be good. Oh, what is this? I've seen this one before. Awakened one. Whenever you play a power card, gains one strength. That's good news. I do not have a power deck. As I play three power cards.
I'll just take my uh, free hit here. Buffered. Oh, I need to actually hit something really hard for the heal. Oh, wallop again. 36. I need to remember that. Uh, where's my pen at? Ten. Six. Oh, man. I think that's lethal. Seven. Eight. Nine. And... 252! I forgot there was a second phase. Obviously that would be too easy. Oh, I forgot. Oh. Hmm. Was the pen. The heart of the spire. You prime your staff to divine energy. It's not enough, but what's the key do? You ask yourself, have I been here before? The heart pulses louder and louder as your consciousness begins to fade. A sudden burst of energy emanates from inside you, jolting you awake. The heart retreats upwards a large door. Oh. Potions always appear. <laughs> the last merchant. Talk to the hand. Deal seven. Whenever you attack this enemy, gain three block. Horn. Whenever an enemy dies, gain and draw one. One vulnerable to all enemies. Well, let's remove useless. Defend. And I think I like this hand card. Potions. That's probably useful. And... Skill. Alright. One dollar, Bob. we have here surrounded back attack deals 50% more damage as it is attacking you from behind so that'll be the one that's ignored that one's gonna attack first if I attack that I'm guessing I turn to the left Take two damage possibly more if I'm forgetting something <coughs> Oh, no, I did that wrong. Oh, I didn't... Oh, right. Ah, uh, whatever. Hmm. 
124. 126. This character does a lot of damage. Calipers. At the start of your turn, lose 15 block rather than all of your block. Oh my god, that's so good. Another stance potion. Yep. Okay, final boss! First time I've ever seen this thing. It's doing a negative effect. And that's good. Whenever you play a card, take one damage. Can only lose 297 more HP this turn. I guess to guarantee that it goes at least three turns. Okay. Oh, I lost my buffer. That's too bad. Alright, this next one is penned. I think I just pass. Or no, that one's clearly good. Oh well, I just lose the pen for a turn. Whatever. Oh, then I guess I might as well do these. Alts for 12 block. Get into Wrath. Vulnerability. Alt. Smite. Slimed. Vigilance. Definitely want to become Ingriff. All right, new potions. Oh. Four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Battle him again. Upgrade all the cards in your hand for the rest of the combat. I think Ritual Dagger upgrades by increasing. Yeah, it's not useful. 135. It's probably good to use. Junk. Hmm. Toss it all. Void. Whenever this card is drawn, lose one energy. I've got the pen, but oh, I should draw three here and save the ritual dagger. No, there's like barely any attacks in here. All right, I guess I'll just max out on 168. Eh, maybe I get something good. I'll probably get something good. That's pretty good.
I should have become calm again so that I could actually save a bunch of this health. Oh well. Eh. Seven. Block return. When attacked, you gain three block. Blah blah blah. Invincible can no longer be harmed. Oh, but still gains. Still deal damage. Or no, no damage. Still gain three for attacking. If I'd wall up before I was invincible, then that would have been good. Oh, pen. Should have penned the wallop. I did it! Hard down on the easiest mode! We did it! We beat the game! Huzzah! Heartbreaker. Defeat the heart. I could have been perfect on this one too, for the mega points. Enter Divinity. Die next turn. Nice. I like it. <laughs> 